overdoses, it's not shocking. Specifically, it's not shocking to me. It is the reason why the past few years I go out looking to see who's going to come out with the Dr. King quote on the Dr. King holiday. Mm -hmm. And I do that so that I can call them out. And anyone who has a clear understanding of the white supremacists, of the hateful racists, they know the reason why these individuals always flock to the one quote of Dr. King's, and that is judging based on one's character instead of one's skin color. Mm -hmm. We understand what it is that the white supremacist, the hateful racist is doing when they choose to splint, spin it, when they try to reverse it, such as the way Governor Stitt did in his tweet in regards to Dr. King and the holiday. Dr. King's dream was the American dream. We're one nation under God with liberty and justice for all. He knew that greatness was determined by the content of our character and merit and not skin color or background. You see, they put that out there. They use that quote for nefarious reasons. They spin it to justify their hatred, their white supremacy, and their oppression of black people. Why? Because they don't believe that black people have character. They don't believe that black people have honor. They don't believe that black people are equal to them, right? They view black people as subservient to them. They view black people as second class citizens. They don't want black people in the boardroom, like I said before. They view black people as their maids and their butlers, as their gardeners, as the drivers of their limousines. They view black people as good enough to be picking cotton nothing more. And so now they have taken Dr. King's words to spin it. So because you aren't in this higher position, it's not because we've oppressed you. It's not because we've put in um, systematic laws that keep you down. No, it's because you aren't as great as we are. It's because we are simply superior to you. We don't judge you based on your, your skin color. Yeah, your character tells us that you're nothing more than thugs and criminals. That is the reason why they always flock to that specific quote of Dr. King's. Because they've spun it in their mind that, yeah, they're, they're judging us based on our character. And we're just simply not as great as they are. And to close out, you will never find them, ever find them, quoting this. Preacher philosophy, burn, baby, burn. I'm going to say, build, baby, build. Organize, baby, organize. decided to stick with love. Somebody's got to have some sense in this world. And a lot of white folk have demonstrated eloquently that they don't have no sense. And why should we be that way? The reason I'm not going to preach a doctrine of black supremacy is because I'm so sick and tired of white supremacy. Amen. Nope, you will never find a hateful, racist, white supremacist who quotes Dr. King's judgment of character versus skin color. They will never, ever quote that.